breaking news. Police say they've arrested the man who attacked seven Asian women on the same night. And tonight we are learning new details about the suspect. Good evening. I'm Maurice Dubois. And I'm Christine Johnson. Police say the suspect assaulted the women, hitting them in the face. CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis live at the Midtown South Precinct Station House with the breaking details tonight. Jenna. Maurice and Christine, that man is facing hate crimes charges after police say he attacked seven Asian women in the span of two hours. A short time ago, he was walked out of the Midtown, Midtown South Precinct here. You can see in video, that's 28-year-old Steven Zajonk. He exited silently with his head down. He was taken into police custody today following a string of attacks targeting Asian women Sunday night. Police say seven women were targeted in different incidents from about 6.30 to 8.30 p.m. Police say the women range in age from 19 to 57 years old. We're told no words were spoken and they were punched or elbowed in the face. The victims mainly suffered a swollen face and cut lip. However, one woman was treated at the hospital. This map shows where the attacks happened, stretching from Madison and East 30th Street to East Housen and Mott Streets. Now, we're told that man made no statements to police, so the motive is not clear, and we're told he has no prior arrest history here in New York City. He's believed to be homeless here in New York with an address in Florida. We're live in Midtown. Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News. Jenna, thank you. I stand in solidarity with the Asian community and all non-black people stop Asian hate. And make sure y'all backtrack through his trail of terror to see if there's any other unsolved crimes in these areas.